International Women's Day fell on the weekend. Many organizations are utilizing the first working day of the week to celebrate those who are proud to be who they are, women. TBC's communication is in the front row here and correspondent Sharon Ejasson joins me there uh, from, uh, from the uh, venue where we are holding it. Sharon, tell us, how is it going down there? The women have been celebrated today. How much would you say, would you tell us uh, is, is transpiring over there? Well, the room is charged up here. A um, lot of activities is actually going on. We've had um, notable women in the industry speak to women of like minds on how they can actually fly high in the different sector of fields they find themselves in. I have with me the managing director of um, the Nigerian Port Authority. She's been with TVC News all morning, but there are one or two things that I think she could actually share to workers on how um, women can actually um, excel in whatever fields they find themselves in what more what's your advice to the average nigerian worker well my advice to the average woman is for her to work harder as a woman you need to work three times as hard as the man to excel so get in there do your best and you will succeed and you will shine also there's a need for us as women to share our circle of influence it's not an either or you're not in competition with yourself so don't pull each other down there's enough for all of us as women to excel and for all of us to shine so it's not either Either you or her but both of you and all of us would shine and we can shine so what would be your expectations from um, a woman if she's having any challenge in actually um, excelling in whatever field she finds herself in how would you advise a woman to actually um, move away from that particular challenge um, I think we should think um, beyond outside the box, um, understand what your issues are and work outside of the box to address them. Um, never agree on constraints, look at uh, the solutions, lean out, um, reach out for support and a support system would come for you and what's important is a lot of us that find ourselves in position of authority, we need to lean over backwards and accommodate the younger ones that are coming uh, uh, along, ensure that they are given the necessary support um, provide them with leeway to enable them grow. Um, there are certain challenges we have in the course of our lives and in those particular critical points women should come together to support each other and provide that enabling environment for the girl to shine. Thank you very much for joining us. We've heard from the Managing Director of Nigerian Port Authority. There are other speakers um, at the event, um, TBC International Women's Day, and a um, lot of women are actually asking more questions on how they can excel in their various fields. Well, I really can't say that I wish to be a woman, but then you being a woman out there, and then we have it being celebrated from Monday, the noise is out there in the country. How would you say it makes you feel, Sharon, to be being a woman, being celebrated internationally? Well, I think it's um, a good time to be a woman. A um, lot of challenges um, have been um, existing in the past in terms of how high a woman can actually fly. But we have uh, many women on the table um, today and um, asking questions, holding place of authorities, trying to make impacts to their own society and contributing their own quota. So this is a message also um, to everyone that has a company or that has a business. That female input is important because, of course, a woman is more, uh, more cautious and more knowledgeable at, in some occasions in terms of handling situations and ensuring that um, there is total growth, economic growth for all. All right, um, TVC News correspondent uh, Sharon Jackson, live for us from the International Women's Day, being celebrated from our company.